Uh, Jordan, can you explain that game? Can you can you put it into words? Um, I think obviously gutting. I think the way it's ended. Um, but I think before the game, if you say we'll come here and get a point, off the back of Saturday's performance and result, I think um, it's a good point. Another point on board. Um, it's just the way. That obviously, we had we had three kind of in our in our hands and um, a little bit of lapse of maybe concentration and got them a little free header in the box and then obviously they put it away. Um, I thought we, after the start, obviously they've come and they've come and uh, matched us up, um, which is a real compliment to us, I think. Um, come into Fratton Park and they've they've matched us up and gone gone high press and because they know how dangerous we are. Um, obviously, it was a tough start. They've scored early, so I think to come back into the game like we did and just to be so close, it's um, it's gutting. But um, like I say, another another point on board and a good point. I suppose in a week, maybe even a couple of days' time, you'll look back at the two games against AFC Wimbledon. Started the season really well, and today to come away with four points from those two trips is not bad, is it? Yeah, definitely. I think it all um, depends as well on Saturday. Um, if we if we can get a win, then this is, is a very good week. Um, two tough games away from home, we picked up four points. Um, like I said, this is always a tough place to come. So I think before the game, if you say we get a point, it's a, it's a good point. It's just so frustrating to come so close to to getting the three points. And I think it was a perfect. Um, Perfect game, game plan away from home. We were, we were strong. We were resolute. We, we counted well. Um, yeah, just, just frustrating. <laughs> um, what was it like playing in? Because I was exhausted watching. There was a lot going on, lots of challenges, lots of noise, lots of kind of attempts here, there, and everywhere. It kind of felt like a, like a big game. Did it feel like that when you in the middle when you were playing? Yeah, definitely. It always is here. It's, um, it was intense, intense game. Um, I think you've got to be concentrated. At, for, for every minute of the game, um, especially in the midfield, it was very tough. I got up against, I was up against Harness, and then the two boys in front of me were man marked as well. Um, just kind of almost going with us everywhere. So it was it was tough, tough to get on the ball. Um, but like I say, coming away from home, I think we we really dug in and did the dirty stuff well. And and yeah, just just frustrating, very frustrating. But a good point, good point. A good point. And as you said, we go on and, and have two home games now, which you know is a great opportunity. Because let's face it, we're still unbeaten after the first game of the season, so it's not as if this is like a complete downer, is it? And these two home games are a big opportunity to pick up more points. No, definitely. I think just the way it's come, obviously the goal—if they score in the 70th minute—it's not as yeah. it's not as gutting. But it's just the way it's come in the last last few seconds of the game. Um, but there were so many positives to take from from everyone throughout the whole team and in both games. I think it's, it's been two very good performances away from home. Um, we know it's not always going to be easy and nice, pretty football, and but hopefully now we're going back home and we've got a couple of home games that we can put a bit, have a little bit more control maybe at home um, and hopefully get get a couple of wins and, and push forward and and yeah, looking, looking forward to those. Just a very final question on Ryan Hardy's finishing. Not bad today, was it? Not bad. I think um, <laughs> he's got the the chop. Well, I hope he doesn't do it too often because I think people will start to yeah. read it. But um, as long as he keeps putting it away, I don't really care what he does. Um, but no, nah, he's he's um, he's on top form. Yeah, um, him and Jeff's up there have a real handful. Um, I know before the game, Pompey were talking about kind of playing up against two strikers, and it doesn't happen very often. And I think those two are at the moment. I don't know any strikers in the league that are, that are doing any better. Um, they're a handful. They're working hard. They're eager to learn. Um, so I'm sure they're they're only going to get better. But um, I think it comes as well from their work rate and their intensity off the ball um, and it just it just sets off the whole team really um, so yeah they need to keep it up and hopefully we can keep it up as a team